What's a gas? What's a gas? Oh, I, I screwed up. Um, what? I have a bunch of outside. <laughs> What's up, guys? This is Alfie here, back with another video. So, if you're a fan of Cold Zombies, yep, the video for you. If you're a fan of Lego and Cold Zombies put together, this is definitely the video for you. Because I have made some of the bosses of Cold Zombies. I've made denizens. The most stupid boss in the entire games. <laughs> Panzer saw that. Brutus. And all here, George Romero. From four different maps. So let's get into the video. First of all, let's talk. Let's do talk about the denizens. Simple little thing. Look, it's just simple. Just simple little monster. Look at it. So it just took um one of the heads off and the Gringotts or Harry Potter. Yeah. Then yeah. three flat like that. A one, stuff like that, and then two other stuff like that, and then another flat by three, one by three, and just boom, like that, like that, boom, mission accomplished. Okay, let's go on to the panzer sold out now then. Oh, and just a little tip. When you're playing transit, do not run into the um, fog, okay? This is where these things come. So yeah, let's move on to the Panzer Sold Out. I'm back Boom. with the Panzer Sold Out. So if you didn't know, this is the um, Panzer Sold Out from Origins, where I've got the flamethrower and the grappling hook thing, my Bob, where I just bring it towards it and stuff. So this was like this actually took me quite a bit of time to actually figure out, to be honest. Because it had to have like really chunky legs and this is not um like the full project of it. I'm gonna make another version of it. And yeah, this is actually really cool to be honest. It's got the whole front full uh... I couldn't make the thing so it's like the wire goes into there. I think I kind of done that both and I put the um, arm on like that. Arm um, plus the flame flow you can take off. You can take off the flame flow really like, simple. And then it's it's really hard to get on with one hand. Wait one second. I've got the thing back on. If you have die um so yeah. It's actually really cool, you know, it's got like the little details there, like the, the hand. Made some feet with like just one by two radiator studs, well, bricks, and um, a silver helmet and the um, arc heads from the hot. The Hobbit series. It's good. Give it a little close up there. Sorry if the graphic isn't too good. My um, iPod hasn't been working very well recently, so. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, so this is actually really cool. So, I'll see you guys. Ah! Okay, I'm back with Brutus. So, if you didn't know, Brutus is from Mob of the Dead. Like, like one of my favourite maps of all time. Probably one of yours as well. And I've done it where he spawns in. He's like, oh, and then he comes out of the ground and then he's like, he's, co he's like covered in fire and stuff. And then he, if you didn't know, he just chases you around. And when you use the plane and go to the Golden Gate, you'll find like a thousand of these guys running after you. I just love, like, the blue was like it's cool he's got his like baton i used the um init drago um snake commander um chest plate pieces for like he has like the little leather padding on it and then barbed wire i couldn't really make the barbed wire so i just put this because like the spikes barbed wire and barbed wire on his back 
I put a helmet on him, you can see, the cool helmet. I put the just the bell lav at the bottom of it. The normal police torso. And yeah, let's move on. I have no idea why I'm even built made this boss. I hear this boss. George Romero from Call of the Dead. I actually like Call of the Dead. I, I just wish they would just take out George Romero on the fog. Then the game would, then the map would actually be cool and fun and stuff. So yeah. If you didn't know, he was kidnapped by zombies. And uh, yeah. So then he was infected and now he just walks around you know, creepily and um, he holds like a giant um, broken stage light thing. Crap. Come on, just hold it. Yeah. Okay, um, I'll see you So then. yeah, I'm back with George Romero. I probably could just a skier helmet on because I couldn't really find any other heads with glasses. I couldn't find any slick back hair thing, so I just had to go with that. I put a shovel through the camera pieces and then a red lava stud and then a yellow lava stud, as I like to call them. And then like a giant um, wooden stick. And that's it for Drive Romero. Let's move on to the next one, which is actually nothing. I'm just going to go over the layout. So we're um, back with all my bosses. So in total, there's four. So just to go over it again, we've got the Denizens, Panzer Soldat, awesome, um, Brutus, absolutely beast, and I hate Josh Romero. So um, this is a little bit from Transit, just like a bit of lava. This is like trench side for the um, Panzer from from Origins. If you're asking what this is, this is supposed to be the tank thing that like takes you around the map, but I can really it I can really find some stuff so for it. So. Yeah, um here is Brutus with like the gel door and the hand. But little Easter egg, this is actually the golden spark. Yeah, I can really make the blood bath, but let's just move on to Joy Romero. So he's got his little um snowy bit for the um snowy map called it red um i think thinking of putting the lighthouse in but i couldn't be bothered so these are three flat two by four pieces um and then i used a one by two piece there and then a one by four piece there I'm just looking at my iPod, so I might not be able to do it, but... So, yeah. There we have it, folks. There we have it, folks. This is another video from off your end, just to remind you, I guess. So, yeah, and please sign into a YouTube account, if you have one, that is. And please subscribe for more awesome content. And leave a like rating, if that really helps out the channel. So I can make more videos, and I'll have so much fun. I have so much fun making them, but this one was actually a bit hard because I haven't been feeling very well lately. And it was actually, yeah, I actually like doing this. So if you're asking why I've just done a video about my dog, that was because I've been very busy since I got my little puppy. So if you don't, if you have haven't seen the video, I'll leave a link in the description. Well, I can't really link the description to it, but I'll tell you what it's called, okay? So, yeah, I'll see you in the next video, and I hope you leave a like, click, and subscribe. Peace!